How about uh, keeping your floors clean after you've cleaned them? From Grassworks, this is your set of two dirt trappers. They're the outdoor AstroTurf mats, and they look nice, but here's what's so great about it. they These tiny blades grab, hold, and hide dirt beneath the surface. So right now, maybe it's a lot of like just yard dirt in and out of the house. In the winter, maybe it's the salt. Um, maybe, well, actually, this would be great to put in front of even a kitty litter box. Let me take you to the colors because you're getting two of them. If purchased separately, it would be over $47. I'm happy to say that we're doing it for four easy payments of $8.07. So you're going to get two. I'm going to show you the colors, though, just one of each. But please know you will absolutely get two. So so here's your light tan. We also have it available in the dark tan, which is really if you like that um, look of that kind of natural cocoa matte, which is so popular, I would say get the dark tan. Here's your light gray, which is very pretty. And then here's your dark gray. Light tan is now most limited, and this is our final order of the year. So I want to say hello to John Holt. He brings us all kinds of great cleaning solutions. And you know, John, you were one of the people who really taught us that your floors will stay cleaner if, wild concept, if you can actually <laughs> stop dirt from coming in from the outside, right? Imagine It's that. so if simple, but yeah, we don't think about that. If the dirt doesn't come into your house, you don't have to take it out of your house. And this is really going to be your number one cleaning secret. Less sweeping, less vacuuming, less mopping. Now, in here, I've got five pounds of dirt. That is about a month worth that normally comes into the average home. 40 pounds a year comes into your house every single year. Now, this much dirt is in this mat already. You don't even see the dirt in the mat, do you? No, not at all. It looks clean, right? Here, let me show you something. I'm going to put this one down. Okay. Now, what I want to do is take a month's worth of dirt. I'm going to come closer to the camera so you guys can see this. Watch this. You all know of that how dirt badly not going in the house. That would scratch your hardwood floor. It gets your carpets mm -hmm. dirty. Now, I, I just put a new deck on my house last year after 22 years here. I, and I don't want my deck getting all scratched up. So underneath this mat, that is a slip-proof backing, number one. Number two, all of the dirt that goes into this mat stays in the mat. Now, here's how it works. This is what the mat is made of. Thousands of these little scraping blades that gets up into the ridges of your work shoes, your running shoes, your dress shoes. Then the dirt falls to the bottom of the mat and it stays there. And so the next person that stands on the mat stands on a clean mat. Isn't that clever? It's okay. perfect. And you're getting two. So now you have front door, back door. Maybe you want to put one at your deck. Maybe you want to put one. You know where I'd like to put one? One in front of my front door, but in my garage, inside my garage before you step into my house. Like right. a lot of garages go exactly. right into the kitchen. Be great sure. to put it in there because here's the deal, John. I think about like, Jane, I am forever, like every day of my life, I <laughs> vacuum my foyer because we've got lots of, the dogs are running in and out, the kids are running in and out. Me, my husband, I'm gardening a lot, bringing in dirt. John is so right. If you can stop the dirt from coming into your house, oh my gosh, that's 90% of the battle. <laughs> And then you see those little foot things and we're good to go. I know, exactly, exactly. <laughs> All right, if you want light tan, we're down to our final 600 of the year right now. Dark tan is the most popular. And then we also have our grays. We have this light gray, which is more of like a silver. We have the dark gray, which is a deep charcoal, a little bit almost black. You get two for this price. Now, if purchased separately, it'd be over $47. We're doing it for four easy payments of $8.00 and seven cents so sixteen dollars a piece you know john i couldn't run down to you know the big box store and get a good sure. mat for sixteen dollars this is an exceptional mat it's grass works. it's great and you know most doormats that you buy in a store and i don't know why they do this they're only 24 inches wide your door is three foot wide this yeah, mat thank you. is three foot wide. Okay, you I'm so glad you said you this because here's the other thing. <laughs> okay. Those 24 inch mats, aesthetically, they always look too small for the front door, right? Exactly. You put them down and you're like, well, I, this mat I bought just looks dinky. <laughs> this is 36 <laughs> inches, so it's going to trap more dirt, but it's also size wise going to look better in front of your front door. And John, it, it does. you're putting that dirt in there. As I right. bring dirt, you know, as I'm walking and I have dirt on my shoes that comes off before I step in the house, 
I'm not shaking this mat out every day. You're saying maybe once a month. Yeah, you know, I mean, I've got a blacktop driveway, but if you've got a dirt driveway and you're bringing groceries in on a rainy day, yeah. you don't want to take your shoes off six times. Now, I'm showing you that I'm pouring the dirt in the mat, but look, when I wipe my feet on it, I'm still standing on a clean mat. The bristles on this mat, they're an inch tall. You know what cocoa mats are. They're they are popular as well. well and but they, actually, but they, they have down. too many bristles. So okay. the dirt sits on top of a cocoa mat. All of my dirt goes to the bottom of the mat. So the oh. second, third, the 40th person that stands on its mat is mm -hmm. actually wiping on a clean mat. Look, I almost put another five pounds of dirt into this mat. I'll, I'll just empty this whole container here. Now, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to pick this up and I'm going to shake it out. Here is another month's worth of dirt that didn't oh come gosh. into your house to scratch your hardwood floor. Yeah. This becomes your number one cleaning secret. And they I last. put my hardwood floors in 22 years ago. Uh -huh. There's no scratches on my hardwood floor. I've always had these by, this is my main door right here. 20 feet down there, I got my mudroom door. Around the corner, I've got a slider that comes out of my kitchen. Every one of my doors has this mat well, and it'll last it and longer. Decades. Those cocoa mats eventually break down. This won't break down. So here's they your do. light tan. You're getting two of them for four easy payments of $8 and change. So $16 a piece. Here's your dark tan, your light gray, and your dark gray. John, thank you so, yes. so much. <laughs> Hey, say hi to Jane for me. I absolutely <laughs> will. Okay, hi. Jane. What? Because we used to clean 